Hey guys, in this video, I will show you how you can fix PS5 uh, games crashing, right? So without further ado, let's get started. First of all, go on settings, then uh, on the top right, then go to users and accounts, then uh, go to account, or not account, I'm sorry, uh, you need to go to other and restore licenses and press restore. And then look if the problem persists or not after you do so. Then another thing that you can do here is to go to uh, on options again, go to captures and broadcasts, then on captures and broadcasts, make sure to go to trophies and then here, make sure save trophy screenshots is none and also save trophy videos is none as well. And then look if the problem persists or not. If the problem persists, go completely turn off your PS5. Uh, we need to wait for a couple of seconds until uh, there is no uh, light here. Then uh, you need to connect your uh, controller with a cable, uh, with your PS5 and controller. And once uh, the light is completely turned off, I will show you what you need to do here next, right? Uh, light completely turned off, then just press and hold power button until you hear two beeps. So the first one, and then we need to hear another one. Second one, right? So we uh, enter the save mode. So I need to switch back to my PS5 here. And here we need to tweak a couple of settings, right? So uh, the first step, what you need to do here is to just press PlayStation button here. And then here uh, you will have this uh, menu, right? So the first thing what you need to do here is to go to uh, update system software and uh, update using internet, right? And after you do so, go back, go to clear cache and rebuild database, uh, select clear cache. It's just a cache file, don't worry, it, will, it won't delete any of your games. And then rebuild database and look if the problem persists or not. And still, if the problem pers persists, if the game is crashing, freezing, and uh, you cannot play, what I suggest you to do here is to reset a, a, your PS5. So this means all the settings will be on default and also all the games and all the apps that you have, it will be deleted. And so it will be like you just bought a PS5. So uh, if none, none it helps, just reset PS5 here, right? So yeah, that's pretty much it.